Great to have you with us. I'm Joe Donlin. And I'm Marisa Vedra. A cyclist violently run over in Wrigleyville as crowds were pouring out of a concert at the ballpark. She was riding a pedicab, one of those bikes that carries passengers. New for us tonight at 5, our Charlie DeMar spoke with her. And Charlie, this really could have turned out a lot worse. And Joe Murray, that driver is physically and mentally banged up after she was run over right here at Clark and Addison, as you mentioned, right in front of Wrigley Field. And she tells me that she feels that the driver of that bus is getting off easy, that he isn't actually being charged with what he did. And we do want to warn you that the video you're about to see may be hard to watch. He hit me and had taken off and I was thrown onto the ground. Cell phone video shows the driver of a minibus with a psychedelic paint job deliberately run over Sarah Yap in her pedicab right outside of Wrigley Field after a dead -in company concert around 1230 Sunday morning. He said sorry, a mouth sorry before he completely just no disregard for my body. I was like, there's no way this guy's gonna hit me. You know, like it's a festival where usually the people are very loving and hippies and happy. After hitting Yap, the driver who has been identified by Chicago police as 40 year old Brian Rollins from Berkeley, California, didn't stop. In the video, you can see bystanders running after the bus. He was eventually arrested and charged with misdemeanor DUI and a number of traffic violations, which included failing to report an accident. He's definitely getting off. I mean, Yap, who has not only lost her peace of mind, but her livelihood, is angry that the driver isn't facing stiffer charges, which is why in part Yap wants you to see this video. These are not ticket offenses. I can't imagine if I, you know, I, I mean, I'm someone's daughter, I'm someone's friend, I'm someone's sister. Like, I matter just because I ride a bike. I'm a professional. If I was even like a foot up more forward than I was, I would have died. I mean, the bike, my bike got wrecked. And just before hitting Yap, Chicago police say the driver of that bus hit two other cars. Yap has set up a GoFundMe to help her with her physical recovery and also to get her bike repaired. We are live in Wrigleyville. I'm Charlie DeMar, CBS 2 News. Charlie, thank you.